everybody, um, I'm Nils Pirma, yet again, with T-Shot. So, it's day, day two of, actually, I did a video yesterday about, like, T-Shot Network rendering, and today I'm gonna show you how I do it at the office. So, here's my small laptop, who's, uh, w which is actually doing the management and everything else, and sorry about the cables, I'm in my office as a server hardware engineer, I need to have these cables. <laughs> so, anyway, so... so this thing over here is doing the management, every every bit part of uh, managing it. So what it's actually doing right now is it's rendering uh, an 8K BMW M6 prior design that Noorio has has given me the model for. So it's an 8K, everything's on the max, samples and everything. It's right now running on 83 cores. I don't know if you can see it. It's got eight computers and it's not running on 83 cores. So sorry about the video, it's kind of blurry and such, but yeah, it's running 83 cores. You don't believe me? So anyways, that's one machine over here. Yeah, yeah that's a Core i7 4770K. What the big boys are doing here, and I quite literally mean big boys, is a server rack. <laughs> So that's doing that. So there's AMD Opterons, 24 cores. So there's an Intel Xeon running 2220 V2s. So there's a hexa-core over here as well. So the Opterons down here. So there are a couple of uh, quad-core Xeons. And that's the big boy with the 24 cores, the Intel Xeon 2220 2220 V2. Is it, pro is it uh, giving out a lot of heat? Of course. So that's my render farm, at least for test purposes in my office. I can actually put that little machine in as well. That's an 8 core machine as well, so I'll in total add 91 cores. Which is pretty awesome. And if anyone uh, wants to ask where I work for, Network Tomorrow. We have, we are licensed Network. Uh, Network Tomorrow is actually a licensed super micro server integrator. We build servers, we do these sorts of things, we test things out, we actually improve on CGI and 3D render times as well by providing people the ability to build a, build a ser server farm, for example, for rendering. So this is a great opportunity. Yesterday I was talking about the opportunity to actually get it working, well today is the day we we'll actually took my server rack and actually did it. So 83 cores, 15 minutes to go. And after 15 minutes, we should have an 8K, 8K fully sampled file. Let's see what happens. So, anyways, it's been an instruction of T-Shot Network rendering yet again. I'm Neil Spearman. I'm signing off right now because I'm really stoked about what's gonna come next. So, anyways, if you want to have a render farm built for you, deal. Well, then Network Tomorrow can do that. So, anyways, ah, sorry about this quality, but anyways, you get the idea. So, bye.